Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. We are going to see how to create add section in the footing layout plan. So we will click on the section. So this is in CF one. So in the in this section we will rename the section name. Here we, this is the section two. We will rename this one as CF one. section cf1 okay in this grid we will adjust little bit here from bottom to up okay now this thick line we can make it thin by clicking on that and we will make it realistic and this one fine so that we can see the river with colors now we will annotate by going to annotate option here are the option we can change the type and spacing okay this number 14 bar 15 centimeter spacing number of bar 41 now tag other bars this one this 16 millimeter dia bar we will make it free to move okay then this type and spacing 16 millimeter dia bar at 15 centimeter spacing number 39 and in the other direction we will take it is not it is tagging same river now we will do it for this one this came down We will delete this one. This this one we need to tag because the perpendicular river we have tagged that 16 millimeter dia at 15 centimeter 39 number. This one now it is coming 16 millimeter dia number 38. So this one we will adjust. We will change this one, this adjust this, yes because this is in vertical rebar type and spacing, this will make duplicate to get a circle in that rebar tagging this okay so there will be a circle so that we can understand this is for perpendicular river this one is same okay now do this for another direction bar this came this side we will drag and draw make it free okay this footing is in aligned direction not uh, horizontal that's why the river tagging going in the other direction we are adjusting this now now we can give some dimension for this footing by align dimension mm -hmm. this 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 to this for clear visibility 
better we don't need to give this dimension we will give dimension at the bottom line from this edge to that edge for 97 centimeter now go to footing layout plan we will drag the section and drop in the sheet and we will change the scale so that it can be seen bigger this drag and drop here in this way we can draw other sections and we can drag and drop other sections in this sheet so after adding the other sections here this is the scenario three sections we have added here see now can we now we can make the sections little bit bigger okay same this one this will be a little bit bigger and last this one bigger now our sheet is ready now we can print this sheet into pdf or we can print this in printer little bit too we are adjusting this plan footing layout plan so that it looks nice drag and drop this schedule here move this one now go to print this is print preview we will change the print option here is the options and select the sheet size okay this one okay preview now this is okay we can print this one okay Now this is printing. PDF has been created. So this is the sheet we have prepared. Here in the sheet owner name, page name we can add by project information. Go to project manager. Here we can write the information so that all the sheet will have this informations for example we are writing this for this project decode bd is the and owner name client name client name we for this time we are writing mr viewers or something for all of you okay this is the name coming here we can change the letter size double click on this this little bit move and text size make it small then load it into project save save okay so now this is adjusted to the area we can change this information also ok putting the outline
press the bell icon on the YouTube app and never miss another update.